day five of the intra 90 day challenge. So this is my intra. And today we're going to talk on astragalus, astragalus root. Did I say it correctly? Astragalus root. This is the first time I've heard of this root. Astragalus root. It's astragalus root. So this intra has 23 botanical extracts and fruit juice that supports immune health system. And astragalus root is one of the herbs. So according to the pamphlet here, astragalus root is used in soups, extracts, and pills. And it's used in the treatment of numerous mixtures with other herbs, including heart, liver, kidney disease, cancer, viral infections, and immune system disorders. Astragalus is, is used to help maintain a healthy immune system. Its researchers mentioned that increased attention has been given on the plant-derived saponins. Now, saponins are phytochemicals that are known to help fight infections. And when used on humans, saponins seem to help immune system and protects the body against viruses and bacteria. So astragalus uses a tonic. It's used in traditional Chinese medicine to tonify the spleen and augment the qi, the vital energy for spleen deficiency, lack of appetite, fatigue, and diarrhea. It's also used to tonify the lungs and prevent frequent colds. Western herbalists began using astragalus as an ingredient in various tonics in the 1800. So other benefits include astragalus can improve the effectiveness of conventional diabetes therapy. It's also used for a thickener in ice cream. So what does astragalus look like? And this is the plant. This is the astragalus. And this is the astragalus root, which they use for the intra. And this is another picture of it. So this is astragalus root. And this is intra. And this is one of the herbal herbs in this intradietary supplement. So usually you take one fluid. Oops. I have filled it to the brim. One small cup of this. Cheers. One cup of this or two cups a day. So this is 30 ml. So if you want to know more about Intra, I'm a distributor, so you can DM me. Let's go.